So let's take a look at a discussion forum and kind of dissect it a bit. This is from module two, what you notice in module one. And you'll see I started this conversation and it was very much an, an assignment. I, I was looking for something specific and this was my the chief clause of what I wanted folks to do, to reply, commenting on anything you saw. I don't believe I gave you the option to start a new discussion. I wanted you to follow this path. I gave a quick sample, all right, with one quick thing, and Nancy replied to, technically, to my sample, but that's fine. I replied to Nancy, and you'll see how these are kind of staggered, okay, my reply here, Nancy's is a bit inset, and then I am inset from Nancy. And you'll see in my comment that I use her name. I, I'm speaking right to her. So hopefully Nancy comes back, and I'm sure she did, took a look and said, oh, Dave spoke to me. That's really cool. Barbara, very cool, also spoke to Nancy, and that conversation continued. Pete came in, and he came in... Actually, he came in before Nancy. He came in right after me. Okay, that's what occurred. Nancy, Nancy brought the conversation in a bit. So Pete replied right after I did. And he's talking about the whole thing. Um, he gives some specifics. Very cool. And he points something out. Um, I think he pointed out something about wikis. Yes, I had difficulty with the editing tool on the wiki. And I responded roughly three hours later with a little quick, I neglected to provide a tutorial. Ah, my bad. Um, Becky also, um, also joined in. She added really onto my comment. And Sherry replied, again, her reply over to the left was to the first main comment. So you see how things tend to be broken in a little bit. If I wanted to reply to Becky here, who came in a little bit afterward, um, she was traveling, but if I wanted to leave a comment just to Becky, I'd hit reply here. And that would then put my reply inward. So I'm going to um, say something really quick. Um, Yep, I see the problems with not having a checklist. And I'm going to post that. And let's just see where that lined up. Um, yep, see how that came in? That was inset a little bit. I'll delete that for now. So that's roughly how it works. The replies to the direct main forum up here stay lined up on the left. But the sub-replies, the replies to the replies, get noticed under here. So when people say something, like when Pete says something, he should be coming back and saying, oh, Dave commented on my reply. That's really cool. All right. Were he just to, or were anyone just to go to the bottom and say, okay, let's see what the latest is, then you might miss several sub-conversations going on. All right, so that's one thing to stay aware of. The other thing is that you'll notice some people um, have replies, and some people have replies from me and others. And let's see if anyone had no replies. And actually, Barbara's comment down here had no direct reply. Um, now, it came in Saturday, the week, and Sunday, but ideally that would have had a reply, if not from anyone else, at least from the instructor. So things occasionally do <laughs> break down, as you'll know. But anyway, that's a quick overview of a very basic one question, many student replies with some teacher interaction. All right? Were this to be the kind where I really wanted you know, big conversation in here. I would say in my my setup here, 
that I'd like to see perhaps three comments from you over the space of four days. Or I'd like you to post and reply to three other people. And that would really add great layers to this forum. I didn't do that intentionally because we're doing a lot of different things, and that's not what the purpose of this was. But that is a way to really force interaction is by saying in the original, re the original post, you know, your role as a participant is to post your ideas and then comment to three other people about their ideas. That way, there's much more interaction. One button we haven't talked about here, the show parent. If you do have a lot of people in a class and conversations are really getting layered, you can click show parent and you'll see what the person, what you are replying to. So clicking that on Barbara's, um, oh, it is showing the parent. The parent is right here. Okay. But when you click that, it, it's showing what's right above. Um, were there a great many links that would be more necessary? So I guess that's why it's not doing anything. All right. And that's it for this portion. Thanks.